Leopard seals look so cute, don't they? You wouldn't expect a creature with such lovely eyes to harm you, especially since, on TV, seals were always represented as playful animals who like to goof around with humans. But leopard seals are apex predators you shouldn't trust that much. After all, they got the name after a black spotted coat, similar to the one a big cat has. That means they're at the top of the food chain, with rarely any other animal ready to oppose them. It's not that common, but there are known cases where they attacked humans. They're generally more aggressive than other seals. And they're not animals that play well with others. Generally, they prefer to spend time by themselves. The ends of their mouths are permanently curled upward, which looks like they always smile. Since they're solitary animals, finding a partner is harder, so they vocalize to attract it. They even sometimes sing underwater. Dingoes. When you see one, you might think you're looking at an average street dog. But be careful. Dingoes are more closely related to wolves than dogs. They're the biggest land predator in Australia and apex predators. They go after their prey in packs. When they get together, they can confront even bigger animals like the red kangaroo. They generally avoid humans, but when in significant numbers, you should avoid them. Who doesn't love pandas? Because they look so adorable and innocent, they've become a symbol of kindness and peace. Also, they're very lazy since they spend most of their time resting and eating bamboo. Sounds peaceful, but you better not mess with them. If you accidentally cross a panda's territory or the animal senses you're a danger, it can hurt you. They have strong jaws and claws, and in most cases, they're way stronger than humans. They rarely attack humans, but you're safer knowing that pandas are one of those animals you should leave to enjoy their own peace. Slow Loris These animals are so slow that even when something dangerous is approaching, they just stop moving. And don't let their big wide eyes and tiny nose get you. This creature may be adorable, but its bite is venomous and can get you into a lot of trouble. Scientists say Slow Loris tends to mimic a cobra. It's one of the few venomous mammals in the animal kingdom. And they don't secrete the venom in their mouth like a majority of other animals. Their secret lies in a sweat gland on their arms. So when you think about it, it's not a cute teddy bear, but more like a real little monster. The same goes with koalas. They look so calm, but they'll also attack you if they see you as a threat. It's not that they're typically dangerous animals. They spend most of their time high in eucalyptus trees since they sleep 22 hours a day. And if you came across a koala in the wild, the animal would probably just climb higher so it could avoid you. But if it felt threatened, it would most likely use its teeth and claws as a defense. A swan does not only look delicate and graceful, but romantic too. Many associate swans with true love, but in their case, love hurts because these animals could really harm you. If they see you as a potential danger, they'll do whatever it takes to protect themselves and especially their young. First, they will start hissing like a cat and then flap their giant wings. You should already be running at this point because they can use their strong beaks to pull, bite, and hit with their powerful wings. Platypus. This one looks a bit like a mythical creature and a combination of different animals. Take a look at its webbed feet and the snout. Definitely a duck, right? It has the fur of an otter and a paddle tail like a beaver. And they look so graceful when you see them swimming underwater using their webbed front feet. But they're not so elegant while walking on land. You see their nails come out so they can walk better. Also, the males are venomous. You can see sharp stingers on the heels of their rear feet. And remember, they'll use them for self-defense. Poison Dart Frog A toad looks way more dangerous than this small, charming one that looks surprisingly beautiful, considering it's a frog. But in reality, a toad is just not that good-looking. It won't harm you, unlike a poison dart frog. There are over a hundred poison dart frog species, and they all have different toxicity levels. The golden one is the most dangerous, that can take down 10 humans if they only touch it. A hedgehog has a special place in most people's hearts. Looking at this cute creature curling up like a little ball and running so innocently. But it's still a prickly animal that uses the spikes when it feels it needs to defend itself from something dangerous. Its quills can puncture your skin and well, that hurts. The anteater. 
With their warm, benign eyes, anteaters look so harmless. They don't even have teeth to defend themselves and hurt us. But they do have claws. They mostly use them to get food, but they won't hesitate to use them when they believe you could harm them. Also, did you know their tongues are covered in spikes? Yup, that's their main tool for collecting food. And their tongue can be up to two feet long. It's long and narrow, so anteaters can easily maneuver it down into some pretty narrow spaces to look for termites and ants for lunch. Owls are not even that adorable, but they look so shy and clever. Plus, you'd never say they even pay any attention to you. But what can really make them mad is if you come closer and interfere with their nests. They have big, sharp claws, so it's not an animal you want to mess with. They can rotate their heads 270 degrees, so even if you're coming from their back, don't think they won't see you. Kangaroos aren't generally those animals that go around looking for trouble, but if you face them, they're not afraid to stand up for themselves and show you who's in charge. They can go after a human as if it's another kangaroo. Their arms are very strong, and they're even able to grapple with you with their forepaws. But it's way worse when they kick out with their hind legs. Deer look like they came from an idyllic fairy tale, but be careful. Males have antlers, and it can be tricky if you come too close and they perceive you as a potential threat. They also have a habit of trampling private gardens and eating what they find. They can be dangerous for some domestic animals people have in their backyards, especially dogs. Red foxes can't harm us looking like that, right? They can carry the rabies virus, so it's better not to interact with them too much, even though they generally avoid humans. They can be aggressive towards them and some small animals. They're pretty unpredictable, so be careful. Raccoons look friendly and cute, and it seems that the only trouble they can bring is turning over your trash can, but not quite. These little fellas are definitely not afraid to show their teeth when they sense something dangerous, even though it's just you going out to see what's making that noise in your trash can. And their little paws might be cute at first, but they're hiding sharp claws you wouldn't want to mess with. Tarsiers are among the tiniest and most adorable primates in the world. Although the first thing you'd want to do when you see one is to give them a hug, you better think twice. They're not outright dangerous, but they're not fans of humans trying to touch them, so they can react pretty neurotically if that happens. Better admire them from a distance. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.